and welcome back. <laughs> We're gonna have some fun today. I like having fun here. All right. Uh, I Heart Revolution, Makeup Revolution, thank you so much for sending over the Shrek collection. Shrek Forever After. So we're going to have some fun. And these are in the collection. <laughs> Actually, I really, it's uh, I'm All Ears. So it came on this card here. It's totally just, you know, a headband. I, let's see, I, I might have prices on everything. <laughs> uh, $9 US. Let's see now. So we're going to play. Uh, I do have uh, foundation on. I just put on a little bit of blush just so I wouldn't look too dead. I have on the Revolution Conceal and Define in F10. I can actually go between F10 and F11. Lucky me. <laughs> okay. In this collection is also a set of brushes with a brush roll. I should just keep the glasses on because I can't tell you how much these are. Uh, the Fairy Godmother Magic Wand brush set is also $9. I totally love Revolution. Everything's nice and affordable. I unfortunately forgot these were in the box, so I haven't washed them yet. But what I've come to find is Revolution does make very nice brushes. So here's the little brush roll. Oh, hello, Caitlin. I didn't. Oh, I thought I hooked up the TV. Maybe I didn't. Okay, I've got a little tie on the back here. Okay, let's just let me put the brushes in there. There's the brushes. Hi, Laura. I, go, I really got to hook the TV. <laughs> like you can see on the phone. Right. They do make nice brushes. These all have a good cut. Impressive. <laughs> so you have a nice fluffy like powder brush. The headband is about to fall off my head. Whoop. <laughs> ah, kind of a blender. And they do say on Shrek X Revolution, angle brush, and then like a flat packer brush. And then they do have like the little stars at the end. Very cute. And then you can put them right into the case. Might be able to get these in here with the little star. Oh yeah, okay. <laughs> now I put nails on this morning, so of course that's gonna mess me all up. And they fit right in. Okay, they did make the loops wide enough because all the stars are pretty big. Yeah, here on the little, we're going to push it through. Ah, get in there. Trying to do this left handed, it's not working. <laughs> I got the other one in. It'll go in. Come on. There we go. Okay. Y'all get the idea. <laughs> And just wrap it up. All right, get that out of the way. Headband's cute, though. Perfect for when I'm taking my makeup off. <laughs> Let me turn on the TV so I can actually see comments in a second. <laughs> I had it plugged in. I forgot to turn it on. There we go. Now I can see what's happening here. Okay, yes, I definitely have Laura and Caitlin. <laughs> All right. Uh, they also sent over I'm a donkey on the edge lipstick in donkey. There's a little donkey. It does have little Mr. Donkey all over it. This is the shade. And that's what's on my lips. A little swatch right there. Nice, easy to wear pink. Lipstick is nine dollars. Is everything nine dollars? <laughs> nope, okay, everything's not nine dollars, <laughs> but cute lippy. All right, then we got this little Gingy, I think that's his name. Yep, Gingy, the highlighter. So he's a little gingerbread man. Now, this is very deep, so. And we'll put it on, but it, it's, I don't think this would really work with my skin tone. It's very deep. Yeah, that will not work on me. Let me here. 
way too dark for me. But I possibly could use it like as a blush topper. Let me get my towel here. Let me try. I'll put a little bit on the brush. Let's see what happens. Oh, yeah, that works a little better like that one. Yeah. So I could use it basically as a blush topper. Like I said, it's got a pink blush on. And it gives that blush a little bit of glow to it. Without leaving a, the crazy cast on my face. He's cute, though. Little ginger bread man. <laughs> Gingy. That box out of the way. I think he's nine dollars too. Oh, he's ten. <laughs> then we have a little cute kitty cat. Oh my god, so cute. Uh this one's Puss in Boots Shadow Palette. Look at those eyes. And this inside says wanna cuddle. I don't want to hear it says wanna cuddle. Yeah. These are cute little eight pans. Out of doubt. I think they're nine. Yes. And then you have what the far quad eyeshadow palette. Hello, Miss Patty. This one here. I'm gonna swatch everything. No worry. And the little palettes, I think they're nine. Yep. Then we have uh what did I do with the box? Oh, it's on the back. What are they calling it? I think it's got down the card. By right one way, by day another. Oh, oh by night, maybe. By night one way, by day another. Um, shadow palette. This is the one where you... Oh, God, how's it going to do? Oh, how are we going to make it flip? Oh, okay, there you go. Goes from, you know, that to that. <laughs> I have to break these nails. Oh, thanks, Caitlin. I might have to look into that. I forgot today's the last day. This is really pretty. You know me, I love my crazy pinks and teals and blues and greens and, you know, it's right up my alley. Uh, this one is $18. And then we got another big one. What's the name on this one? <laughs> this is the Happily Ever After Shadow Palette, and this is 25 US dollars. You can find all this, let's see here. Uh, Revolution Beauty in the UK, Superdrug, uh, Revolution Beauty US site. Oh, and it might end up in also our Walgreens and Ulta. That's good enough. Cool. Let's see, this one here. As a big girl. There. Uh, a lot of pressed pigments in here. There's like a couple. One, two, three, four, five, six. Maybe eight shades aren't pressed pigments, so it's a lot of pressed pigment action in here. But and it, on the inside here, it says the happily ever after. All right, I think I showed you everything, right? And even if you're in the store, you can see on the upper corner of the box, it shows you what the shadows look like inside. And even on the back of this one, same thing. Just so you don't know, have an idea of what you're buying. And, and the kitty cat is the same thing. Puss in boots. All right. Let's get down and dirty. <laughs> and obviously, we're going to do a green look. Shrek. Of course, we're going to do a green look. Right, let me start with the little ones first. These are really cute. Okay. Since these are a little quad, I can just like, do it by the quad. So this is the top four. Right here. Now they have these nails on. It's going to be hard to... Wow, that is... An incredible black right there. <laughs> Woo! Top four. 
We got, uh, oh, okay, I get it. Oh. I think I'm new with this. Four mats up top, <laughs> four shimmer metallics down below. <laughs> Dummy. Oh, that, oh, okay. Wait a minute, it's got, a, oh, it's a squishy one. <laughs> the yellow. Are they all squishy? No, okay. Maybe that's different. I squished my finger right into it and almost pushed it all out of the pan. <laughs> Okay, only the yellow one's real squishy, squishy. It's yellow, though. That's a really good gray. I don't like that shade. Okay. So this here is the What the Far Quad. Okay. There. Cute. Puss in Boots. Okay, same thing. Four mats up top. <laughs> Four kind of metallic shimmers down below. Yeah, they're definitely pressed pigments. No problem, Laura. I know everybody's got to work. <laughs> but me this week. <laughs> and of course, this morning, I was... Uh, up by 6 a.m. Going, are you kidding me? <laughs> I did these two out of order, but. <laughs> Those are the mats. Wow, that red is. That's a good red. This one here. Right, shimmers right there. Gotta be careful, I don't have a, another squishy, squishy one. Nope, no more squishy. Daddy's supposed to be working too. She likes the Puss in Boots one the best. I hope somebody gets it on my finger here. The yellow is pressed a little hard in this little paint one. It's right there. <laughs> it's hard to get a good swatch on that one. So then there's that one down below here. <laughs> oh, I need to give my need my cellar water. <clears throat> oh, I have a nice seat belt cut on my neck here. <laughs> Had a little spider incident in the truck again. I almost jumped out of a driving vehicle as Greg was driving the night we were going out to take mom to dinner. Yeah. It was interesting. I now know that I stuffed my entire body between the front seat and the dashboard with a seat belt on. Because, of course, the spider came down. I, I caught it right out of the corner of my eye as Greg's driving. And we were just coming to a stop, kind of. <clears throat> and I see the little sucker come straight down from the ceiling. And he's coming. And I'm just panicked. And of, I'm, even Greg's laughing, like, why don't you take the seat belt off? I go, because I was about to tuck and roll out of the car. And I'm thinking, at the same time, you think so fast when you're panicked of, oh, my God, if I dive out of the car, the people behind me are going to think I've been, like, kidnapped or something. <laughs> and somehow I did manage with the seatbelt, it was choking me out, but I pulled on it, and next thing I was on the floor of the truck, huddled between the seat and the dashboard. My back's a little hurting today, needless to say. Sometimes pain doesn't kick in until a well, day or so later. <laughs> okay, that will be. These things are fun when they do that. And here's this one. Oh, those blues, those hot pinks. Oh my. Right up my alley. Oh, that's good pink. Oh, I like that green too. <laughs> what did I miss here? I suck at pinky swatches. The dual. Wait a minute. It's a 
two gold chrome. <laughs> okay. Uh, Princess, this shade here. Oh, God. I don't know if you'll be able to see the flip. It goes pink to gold. Go make a revolution, put in a duo chrome. <laughs> yeah, it definitely goes light pink to gold. Because, <laughs> like, it's gold here, and it's pink when I'm looking at it. Wow. All right. Down for that. We like a duo chrome. All right, then we have a light pink next to it. It's gorgeous blue. good so there's your first row top row yeah, another hot pink look at this a duo chrome too this light blue <laughs> we'll find out in a minute Blue one, are you a duo to chrome too? Let's see here. The other shade is right here. It's this shade. It's like a brow bone shade for me, more or less. It's very light pink. Okay. That light baby blue is just like it's not a duo. God, these are really nice shades. <laughs> I love this green, too. Green and pink. So that's row number two. Uh, this is another shade that I can use as brow bone, without a doubt. Oh, this teal. Oh, man. Number three. I hate the pinky swatches. <laughs> I mean, you could definitely do, don't mind, I mean, obviously with these pops of color, but you have enough neutral shades in here where you can pull off neutral looks, but if you want to, you know, start to play with color, you got it where you can do it. If these last three shades are, anybody I know would wear these. Like me. <laughs> I love those, I love a good coppery bronze and all that there so this is the this one <laughs> all the way through there but there's a freaking duo chrome i can't believe there's a duo chrome yay all right let's get that one away gorgeous though look at that mm -hmm. mm. oh my god it's right up my alley okay get those off I got my Selfridges order coming. Yay. Now, Caitlin's got me going to buy the Natasha palette. <laughs> I wouldn't have ordered the Hourglass yesterday if I knew that was going to be in there. <laughs> I thought she was just waiting till after the sale. Oh, this is the second time with the spider in the truck. And both times it's been for mom's birthday, which is weird. I'm like, is it dad messing with me? Because the, the, the truck one was, again, we were in the truck. I shut the door, and then there's a spider on the door. Now, the truck next to us was parked so close of, again, you thinking a million miles an hour. I knew if I threw the door open, I was going to hit the guy's truck, which then Greg would have a tantrum and the guy would have a tantrum. And somehow, I mean, it was a split second. I went from the front seat sitting, kicked somehow off the dashboard, flew through the middle of the two seats and landed on the floor, <laughs> folded in half <laughs> in the back seat, going, screaming, you know, spider and flipping out. So, yeah, but I thought, because it, it, I thought the seatbelt caught me more here, because even with Greg, I was like, am I bleeding? Because <laughs> it, you know, a seatbelt can really do some damage. And I noticed it last night. Well, right here I got cut. <laughs> oh, 
I'm telling you. My, even my mother's laughing, going, I still don't get why you're scared of spiders. I'm like, hey, me neither, but it is what it is. <laughs> I took a diver. But my back is wasted today. All right, now we're going to do the big one. <laughs> and again, this is, anybody can use this. Great for kids, let them play with, you know, color. Because you have everything in here. Browns, greens, purples, pinks, coppers, blues. You've got like your whole color spectrum in here. And if you want to make dual chromes in this one. Going to find out. Are these going any particular rows or anything? No. Okay. And I have seen Shrek, both of them. <laughs> Sometimes with cartoon stuff, it's not my thing, but I have seen Shrek. And it was funny. But there's a lot of like, cartoons I've never seen. Because <laughs> I don't have kids. So it's like, what, certain things, of, why would I watch this? I don't have children. I'm not forced into watching it. But Shrek made it, you know, funny for the parents that got the inside jokes. I think a lot of cartoons tend to do that now. Because they know the parents are going to be with them. Like the last two. Oh, that's a pretty pink. Oh, such a pretty light pink. That one's looking. I don't know if it's a, just a silvery pink or if it's actually flipping to silver. Now I'm going to say that's I'll check some of those. <clears throat> Second row. Let's see what we got here. Green. Oh, that's a pretty lamb green. Some really good mauve shades. Oh, I can't get this with my pinky. I'm trying not to stab everything with these nails on. Okay. These pressed pigments. Did I actually pick up any on the pinky? I don't think I did. No. It's so much easier with the finger swatch. There we go. These are on the lighter side. Lighter toned, I guess I would say. One's matte. One has some shimmer to it. But it's two pinks right next to each other. This one has just a little more shimmer to it. Yeah. Or satin, I should say. Not shimmer. Nice muted purple. Pretty blue. Another purple. All right. These four shades are kind of similar, but they are different. They're similar, but different. It's like, this is a little deeper, a little lighter. Like I said, these are matte. And like I said, with pigments, one extra drop of pigment changes the color. Okay, one, two, three, I did the purple. All right, so we're back to the green. Hot pink. And shimmery white. Not missing that pink, that is for sure. <laughs> a lot of white in there. And that's a sh more of a shimmery white. Look at this pink. <laughs> oh, wow, wow. Lipstick feels really nice too. All right, I can go to this side. <laughs> I have two more rows to go too. Oh my God. One, two, three. First three. I'll screw these up. Did I get that one on there? No, of course not. <laughs> I'll do this on here. Ah. All right. Another kind of orangey, oh, red. 
Oh, this is like a satin red. It's not a matte. It's hard doing this backwards. <laughs> it's like backwards and upside down almost. All right. It's very pretty. Ooh, it's a purpley blue. Oh my God, that's pretty. Nice magenta looking shade. Bang and purple. Oh yeah. like the Kool-Aid guy. <laughs> uh, coppery orange. Nice brown. Metallic. Where are we off there? Okay. So we got Happily ever after. You're here <laughs> and here. So the last two rows are on this side of my arm, and the top three rows are on the hand down. All right. Let me wipe these off. So I want over here. Whew. How are you ladies doing? Everybody doing good? If any of you have Showtime, check out the new show, Let the Right One In. I think it's Showtime. Showtime or HBO? I think it's Showtime. Ooh, good show. Kind of like vampire-y and it's interesting. I got Greg hooked on it in like one episode. I was like, hey, you might want to check this one out. He's like, oh yeah, I'm in. Ooh. Caitlin loves revolution too. Uh-oh, Erica took a diver. Oh no, hi Pyramid. <laughs> Daddy, she loves Shrek. She has two boys, so we've watched all the Shrek cars, ants, bugs life. Princess, Tangled, and is my husband's favorite Disney and mine is Wally. I haven't seen most of those. Actually, hi, Miss Erica. <laughs> Hello, Miss Linda. Missed a lot while I was just watching over here. I did. I survived the spider. Barely. <laughs> hi, Rosie. You imagine though if I would have jumped out of the truck, because it was about because it was like tuck and roll. I would I would have jumped if I if that seatbelt if I didn't have that on. I'm pretty sure I would have opened the door and jumped out. And I can only imagine the poor people behind me. They would have literally been like, "Has this chick been literally kidnapped or something?" It would have been bad. <laughs> and it wouldn't have been good for me either. Nothing like jumping out of a moving vehicle to ruin your whole day. <laughs> Damn. Uh, I don't know which ones I want to use here. I'll do two eye looks, obviously. We gotta do green at the Shrek thing. Try to, try to put the headband back on. Some of you girls didn't get, probably see the headband. Choking me out. Rick wears a neck brace. <laughs> here we go. Oh, see, it's going to start sliding back up my hair. Good. Ooh, come on. Hey. My hair's so fine that stuff like this will try it off sometimes. But it is cute where you know, a little opening. So if you even wanted to probably stuff it with a little paper or something to make it stay open. And the head being cute, though, I think it is. It is adorable. And you know me, I love Goofy. Goofy's right up my alley. <laughs> All right, what do we got here? What do we got here? Hi, Tamara, Miss Tammy. I know, 9 a.m. And the time change just screwed everybody up. 
I was up since 6 o'clock this morning. Linda just bought the Jeffree Star Blue Blood Palette. That's an oldie but a goodie. I actually think I have that somewhere. Yeah, because it was blue, so of course I bought it. We'll do one look out of this one. And then one of the, the big one. But these are cute, like I said, for little four mats on top. Four kind of shimmery metallics on the bottom. And these are travel friendly. I mean, they're so tiny. I can give you gram weights and all that probably too. Wait a minute. I'm guessing these are all like one gram they usually are. I know it's on here somewhere. They are good about that. Uh, the big palette, 1.1 gram each. Where's it on here? Uh, the smaller palettes are 0.55 grams each, so a little over half a gram each, which makes sense because they're half the size of the other ones. And then these would be the standard, which is 1.2 grams. Play with this one first. Off. I think I gave you prices for everything. Yes. Brush. Right. You know I'm wacky, so I still can't believe there's a duo chrome in here. Mind blown. I thought there'd be a matte green in here. It's strange that there's no matte green in this one. I think I need to use one. Mm -hmm. I gotta try this hot pink. That's just screaming at me, too. Who says we have to do two green looks? Oh, I did put eyeshadow primer on, too. Uh, Smashbox, I think I used. I'm waiting on the DHL order with my, uh, pork rinds. <laughs> like, advent calendar of pork rinds. Oh, you may. And there is a Charlotte Tilbury set in there, too. It was actually cheaper at Selfridges than it was at Sephora. Definitely press pink. <laughs> Use the light pink here. Very light pink on the edge. For ha-has, I want to put, I'm going to do it on my hand first. We like to play with dual chromes over different colors. So, got to do it. Because this I might actually put on my lid first. But I want to try it over black too. Then maybe we can, it'll help you guys hopefully see it. Right on the little sucker. Weather's beautiful again today here. Got the windows wide open, back door, front door going. Are you kidding me? It's November. It's not supposed to be like this. This one's from Sugar Drizzle, by the way. And the black is from uh, Gimme Glow. My little thing just came across DHLs down the street or something. Yay. And I'll wait and open them with you, ladies. Don't worry. All right. Let me get a packer brush here. 
Take that dual chrome one. It's the fourth shade in. Pink. It looks really nice over that. There it is over the purpley pink shade. Oh my god, it's nice. Damn, that's good. Trying to get an even across that black. All right. Now, hopefully, you can see it's gold because <laughs> it's actually pink too. It, this is actually a duochrome. Sometimes, that, and don't forget, this is over a black base now too. See purple here, gold here. The light's still coming at it hardcore up here. <laughs> Block the light. <laughs> wow. I still can't believe they have a dual chrome in here. Okay. But I want to put that on my lid now. <laughs> now that I played with it. I'm gonna put it over that pink too. Oh, there goes that band. <laughs> Plan on dyeing my hair too. <laughs> Within a day or two. I just washed it yesterday. So. Yeah, I could use the same brush. We can go green on the lower lash line on that one. Yeah. Go green on the lower lash line. Do, do, do. Uh, I don't think Stila makes this anymore. And it's dead. Never mind. <laughs> I forgot to go through these eyeliners again. Oh, there's another one. No, it's a different color though. That's all right. <laughs> this one still works. I don't think they make this shade anymore either. They took out all the fun shades, it seems like, on Stila. Everything's just back to the browns and blues. And... Or did I buy their new one and it was horrible? I don't remember. Uh, angle brush. I'll go on the outer edge with this one, and then I'll go on with this one. So we could play with two shades. I want to see what these look like. A lighter brush. Let's just. There we go. I do like that tealy color. I'm going to go into the lighter green. I think that one was a matte. <laughs> oh, what am I doing? Meld them together in the middle. Yeah, well, I can use that blue. Hmm. I use that little silvery blue shade in the inner corner. A little NYX for white. I didn't hear them crunching down the driveway. So. Okay. 
I'm just playing again. No big deal. All right. Now, how do I open it? Okay. Come on. This one here. Do do do. But there's, like I said, there's plenty of shades in here to play with. Plenty. see what we got in here <laughs> all right I definitely have a matte light green so I'm gonna go with that first I did put back my dossier bottles of perfume last time. I even stacked them on top of each other this time. I was like, oh my God, I can't fit them all. And I still took like six, seven bottles upstairs. So I was like, oh, okay, which ones do I want to play with now? I mean, it's definitely, it's a lighter green, but it is a light green. I mean, it is. It, it's light. So I'm going to go into the shimmery. Oh, not with that brush on that. Where's my persona? I should pick it up. Let's see. I'm just going to the shade right next to it. Which is this one. Which is more shimmery. That's kind of light though too. You, you don't have a lot of... Well, you, you don't. Not a lot of darks in this palette. Like, we all own 100 palettes. Even if you own 10 palettes, you know. I didn't even think about that. The darkest shades in this palette are definitely the purple. And probably this brownish, orange shade. And the one, well, while the red's even a satin. Yeah, so this is pretty light to mid-tone not you know a lot of deep but the two deepest are definitely that purple and I, just for sake of using that deeper reddish brown shade i'm just gonna go right in with it The very first shade that's right at the top, perfect for brow bone. I forgot for brow, brow bone on this one, didn't I? We don't have a dark, I'm really surprised you're not a deeper. Oh, well, it's not like Shrek's real dark, but I don't know, I thought I was wanting a deep green. Deep green in these. Hmm. All right, what do I want to do? I am gonna go in with because I think the shade next to it was pretty intriguing. This one right here, that's the last shade. It's kind of that copper. brush. Do I have a lighter one I could put in front of that? I might, might change my mind here. <laughs> More golden. I'm playing. I'm playing. Figure out what I'm going to do here. No, I'm going to go with that first one. Go with your instincts. Even that green's a little light for the lower lash line, too. This one here. I can't really see. 
and these are pretty much your two greens. Yeah. I wish I had more green. But yeah, it's just those two. I'm using the bigger one. This one. <laughs> Okay, yeah, here they have a little more, but we already played with that one. Maybe they were trying to stay the color of them, maybe, which makes sense. Angle brush. Oh, no, I want to put the lower lash line. Um, and I go with it's not that you know, yeah, it's like an orangey yellow. So I was thinking maybe that and this together. Yeah. So many orders out. I got a good thing I have that like that Shopify app or whatever it is or route or I don't know, one of them i wouldn't know half the stuff that i have <laughs> and i'm just putting the this i did the matte one first and i'm just kind of putting the shimmery one over the top and then they do have a kind of whitish Shimmer in this one. It's right here, right above the red. And the mir the mirrors in here, they are usable. It's like it's very clear. You don't look like you know a three D character or something. We went a little more crazy on this side, but yeah. There we go. I'm not putting on eyeliner. <laughs> One less thing to take off my eyes. I should have washed the brushes. <laughs> but yeah, if you missed the beginning, there's a brush set. Most of the stuff's around nine dollars, give or take. And then some of them are, you know, the palettes twenty five, but you're getting what thirty shades. One, two, three, four, six, fives or thirty, yeah. And the highlighter. So, little gingy. He is cute. <laughs> I know some of you ladies jumped in later, so it's for sure. And I did put it over this blush. Which is just a pink blush. But if I tried to use it on its own, I'm pretty sure I don't think I'd be able to pull that color off. And then the lipstick is donkey. And I have that on too. And there we go. I do love the headband though. Let's send out the head. <laughs> ah, don't drop it. Okay. Oh, better deal, Linda. There you go. She got that palette for 21 bucks on Amazon. Hello, Miss Teresa. And the cute little headband. Selfridges. It was only like 25 bucks, maybe. Yeah. I, I, I literally bought that. My mom, a coffee sampler and the charlotte tilbury oh no problem Teresa. yeah these ones like i said for the week these ones will be an hour or less it's just so i can more or less show you full swatches because you know my camera is not going to let me swatch all this even if i was double timing it in 20 minutes it's just impossible because that does still only give me 20 minutes of film time and there's a lot of makeup to swatch and you know me i always want to play with it anyway so that's why we're live. But we save our three-hour show for Saturday. 
Oh, see, Patty was a bad girl last week, too. She got two boxes from Ofra and her Ulta order, and she's just waiting on Sephora. <laughs> Thank you, Linda. Oh, even Teresa, now Caitlin's got me going to get the Natasha palette. I didn't think it was launching today. So I ordered the Hourglass one. Oh, God. I bought. I just bought the deepest one, like the Tiger. I don't know. But now I got my thing for the Rouge, or whatever you call it, VIB Rouge. So at least that's done. Yeah, at, le I, at least on the advent calendars, Makeup Revolution has a ton of them too. And other years I've ordered them. I mean, the box came in one time. I, I think it was like a chocolate bar. The box itself had been, no lie, three feet wide by like two feet wide, two feet tall. And it was filled with just like the chocolate bar palettes and the highlighters. And it was an incredible value. I want to say it was like 60 bucks. But even the box it came in, because obviously this, the packaging itself was huge. But that's from a couple of years ago. But I have a, I do have a Makeup Revolution folder for my playlists because I have so much of it and I love their products. <laughs> so I always make sure it's right into there. Yeah, exactly. It's missing some deeper tones, which it needs. Oh, wait a minute. Black Friday is already basically here at this point. <laughs> People have already started putting out the sales. Dossier started theirs. Every, I'm just like screenshot and stuff. I'm definitely going to look into Lethal. Because I want to make Gina a palette from Lethal. Oh, it's in the box. But this is the box it came into. The Shrek. The huge box. <laughs> anything inside? I don't think it does. I love boxes like this because it's great to keep stuff in. Mm -hmm. That's a big box. But I always keep boxes like this. To store whatever in. <laughs> Alright, my loves. I'll see you tomorrow with another Swatch Fest. <laughs> uh, yeah. Maybe Sephora. Because I also got the Rock and Roll Beauty in. Ozzy Osbourne, but I did order my candles from them last night because luckily I didn't realize Ozzy had three candles. They only showed one at Ulta, so I got the one in and then I, I still can't believe thank you again, Makeup Revolution, to, that Rock and Roll Beauty is in with Makeup Revolution, but I don't know if it's made for Makeup Revolution. I'm totally confused because it seems like it's its own brand from what I kind of looked up and I got the whole Ozzy collection came in. So you want to see Ozzy tomorrow or maybe a Sephora haul? I don't, I don't even know. I'll figure it out. I'll figure it out. <laughs> you know me, I just wake up and we rock and roll with it from there. <laughs> but thank you, I Heart Revolution, Makeup Revolution, Percent Over Shrek. It's fun. Not a lot of deeper shades, but this is more to me teenager-ish. But I'm not a teenager, but... I would still rock this palette. You know I would. I would rock all, all these. Even these little guys. They're really cute. <laughs> and the quality's, you know, there. But they're definitely light, medium toned or lighter. There's not a lot of deep shades, though. You know, saw the deepest was that kind of brownish red shade. But like I said, we'll have plenty of palettes if we need to pull another color in. So we're all good to go here. There you go. All right, ladies, I will see you tomorrow with, I don't even know what yet. Everyone have a fabulous day, and I will see you all very soon. Love you. Bye.